infant that's returned to drink. Look at that. Okay, well, it's all happening at the waterhole today. We haven't had to move much at all. That's fantastic. It makes such a change for us. <laughs> Maybe it's the luck that ha James has brought back. Um, James is driving through the Mara, so he, maybe he sent me some luck and things are happening for us now this side. Otherwise, he'd definitely tease me and mock me. So thank goodness I don't have to deal with James's abuse just yet because we are finding animals for you. So he won't shout at me, thank goodness. It's good to have good old James back and I see he's sporting a, a new hat or from what I hear. He's sporting a new hat, so apparently he looks like Crocodile Dundee of the Maasai Mara. <laughs> There's wonderful light on that elephant now. Really very, very beautiful time of the afternoon. So Riti, as I was saying, these crocodiles can stay on land for quite a number of time. Um, they even they'll move from one water hole to the other um, quite regularly. It all depends on the time of year. Maybe from this water hole down to the river, if they're looking to mate, perhaps find other crocodiles. So they do move around from time to time. Uh, mainly at night, though. Mainly at night, not really during the day. And elephant enjoying the water. Oh, that is a beautiful view. Isn't this peaceful? It really is so, so calming just to sit at the water's edge like this and gaze out. <laughs> Hippo just constantly snorting in front of us, blowing the water with their nostrils. I don't know, it sounds like Ellie has found a hippo of her own. Let's go and have a look. I might sit here a little bit longer, seeing as my favorite animal has joined us. 